What's up everyone? This is Joe Sorrentino of New England RC. Got a great new accessory to showcase today for my Rustler 4x4 VXL. Body lights! Because you know how I love my lights, which I have on my old one. This is going to be a little different too. Instead of gluing them to the body like I did on the Rustler orange body, with the blue body I'm going to do something different. I'm going to do what I did with the X-Max. With the X-Max I found that I was actually able to get light coming through the mesh netting of the cover inside where the electronics are that I cover. I didn't realize that it actually could like shine right through it and I don't actually have to attach lights to the body itself. The lights were bright enough they went right through. I thought it was really cool. I'm going to try that again with the Rustler this time. So we've got two sets of body lights. I don't know if it's overkill, maybe, or maybe we'll do try to do some underglow. Maybe I can stick some underneath, some above. We'll see. We'll play around and find out. But needless to say, I thought it would be a good experiment to try. Uh, so we don't have to mess with glue, and we don't have to mess with cutting. This time around, let's keep it neat. Let's keep it clean. It's a beautiful new body. I want everything to last as long as possible. So that's the goal today. Let's go. All right, next up is the body lights. Got a couple of sets here. Start with one. So what I'm going to try to do here is get this set up without taping anything down. I just want to have it inside the body, similar to what I did with my X Max. We'll see how that works out. So, a couple of inputs here. Let's just turn them on and see how that looks. Okay. We'll start with in here. Just kind of bring this light through here. There we go. That's cool. It's kind of working. Okay. And with this side, we'll go through the other side here. And then underneath again. This kind of double layering effect here of lights. There, it just kind of goes around. So here's what I did. So just a uh, little layers, two layers of lights around the center. And then when you close this, it still comes through. So it should still light up the body. And we can test that in a second and see how it looks. All right, so let's just take a quick peek and see what this is going to look like with the body lit up. Yeah, you can see the lights coming through. Yeah, let's turn this light off and we can see it better. See how the transparent body and the blue lights inside it just light it right up. Really cool. And of course, we can do more. Light it up even more than that, which I probably will since I can. So, let's, uh, let's add some more lights. So I got another, uh, another port here, another set of lights. So, opening up the other one. Yeah, that's better. So let's see if I can cut across this time. Maybe do like a through the bar. And again, it's tricky because I'm trying to avoid the fans here. I 
Maybe you can do like a zigzag type of thing here. And I'm sure I'll be playing with this for a while. I don't, I don't know when I'll be fully satisfied with this, but this is just to get the idea down for now. There's one. Maybe, uh, yeah, let's just go this way. Across here, and then through here, and the other one through here. Yeah, it's really lighting up now. Oh, baby, that's a lot of lights. So now you can see there's a lot more lights going on there. And I'm gonna close the cover, still see everything just as well. And now, with the body. Oh yeah, that's really bright now. Yeah, that's going to look awesome. Yeah, that's going to be cool. Look at that, folks. It's nice, huh? And the more lights, the more you light it up. So I like these bodies, they're transparent, painted on top, but transparent on the bottom. So that's why the light goes through. It just pops. It's nice. That's going to do it for today. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. And if so, make sure to like and subscribe to the channel and smash that notification bell to stay updated on when my next video becomes available. Until then, this is Joe Sorrentino saying thanks for watching. See you on the next one.